Cutting trees is one of the important works of rural life. Conventional manual saw needs two people to operate. Mechanized chainsaw is the best alternative for this laborious and tricky job. Chainsaws of many brands are available in the open market. However, still a German MNC is the world's number one in chainsaw. Oleomac chainsaws are also very popular and dependable. Government subsidy is available for this machine under few schemes in many states. But this equipment is costly for an individual small farmer at full cost. However, one chainsaw is sufficient for four to five farmers. Sawing is very fast and easy with this chainsaw compared to manual saws. Vibration is also less. It runs with 2 to 3 HP two stroke petrol engine. It weighs around 4 to 5 kilograms depending on the make and model. Hence, it is not so heavy for the operator in operation. Clean the air filter once in a while if the work is continuous. The saw chain gets lubricated automatically. Hence, be sure of proper oil level before starting the work. The metal bar on which the chain runs is thin but strong enough to sustain pressure while sawing. Sharpen the teeth of the saw chain after continuous work only with the file supplied by the manufacturer of the machine. The operator should know the traditional tricks of felling a tree in the desired direction. Otherwise, it may damage the chainsaw and the operator. It is necessary to have the traditional knowledge of cutting the fallen tree also. Otherwise, the chain bar may get locked in the cleft. If the operator knows these tricks, sawing is very easy with this chainsaw. However, it is difficult to cut a tree with a large diameter with this machine. Apart from these big chain saws, small handy chain saws are also available. An operator can run this chain saw with a single hand and prune the branches like this. Electric chain saws are also available. These are useful for the work in home yards. No doubt, these chain saws make the work of cutting trees easy unlike before. The manufacturers of these outdoor power tools recommend safety wearing like helmet, ear pad, eyeglass and hand gloves. Even though farmers may not use all these, taking enough precaution while using these power tools is quite essential. These chainsaws are available with the distributors of the companies. Coffee, tea and cardamom plantations maintain tall growing trees for partial shade. It is necessary to prune the branches once or twice a year for the regulation of shade. It is difficult to use ladders in this undulating terrain. Mechanized pole pruners from Still and Oleomag companies are quite useful for this pruning work. Working of this pole pruner is similar to the chain saw. Cutting chain bar can be adjusted in five different angles to suit the situation. This telescopic aluminium pole with safe locking system will reach the cutting bar to 10 to 15 feet height depending on the make and the model. This entire machine weighs just 6 to 7 kilograms and hence one can operate comfortably by holding like this. Mm -hmm. 
The main limitation of this pole pruner is the reach of height. We can use it up to 10 to 15 feet from the ground. Both hands are necessary to operate this. Hence, the operator cannot work standing on the ladder. Again, the labor has to climb the tree to prune the upper branches with a sickle. Manual pole pruners are available with the same companies, which will go up to 20 to 25 feet high. These are very systematic and sharp compared to local implements. But the cost of the manual pole pruner is high for a farmer. However, these pole pruners are quite helpful for teak and other agroforestry plantations with large number of trees. Digging pits for pendal or fence posts is a routine work on the farms. Opening large number of shallow pits is necessary in tea, coffee and forest plantations. Earth augers of Still, Oleomac and other companies are useful for these purposes. Single man operated small machines and two men operated heavy duty earth augers are available. This machine runs with two HP petrol engine. We can use the auger bits of 6 to 8 inches diameter for this machine. This earth auger has its limitations. It will not dig a hole properly in the soil with lots of stones and roots and also in dry soils. We have to use big earth augers for bigger pits. However, this earth auger is quite useful in the rainy season in tea, coffee and forest plantations. This machine can reduce pressure on the labor by attending at least a part of the work. Yeah.